everyone, Rose from Bridgewater Public Library. Welcome back. So today we've got cookies, cookies, and more cookies on our mind. So we're doing a cookie cutter pour. So I'm using this little gingerbread man and we're gonna use him to help us with our painting. So speaking of cookies, we are having a cookie recipe swap. In the past, we used to do cookie exchange and everyone would bring three or four dozen of my chocolate chip and she, someone else would bring three or four dozen of their snickerdoodles or whatever. And then we would exchange and you would leave with a variety. Can't do that this year, but we are going to swap recipes and a photo of your recipe. The deadline is December 15th, and all you have to do is email me at rmanicos at salesinc.org. <clears throat> email me um, your recipe and a picture of the, the, the recipe. Pic not the picture of the recipe, the picture of the baked good. So your recipe and a photo that goes with the recipe. So then what we're going to do is I'm gonna take all the submissions, gonna make a video of it, um, put it on all our social media sites, YouTube, Instagram, Facebook. And we're also going to print out uh, copies of all the um, submissions and make a little book. And you, would, you will be able to get a book. Um, so I thought that would be fun. Everyone on staff is going to do it. And it doesn't have to be an award-winning cook. It's just something that you always have at the holidays. Even if it's a slice and bake out of the free freezer, that's fine. So that's why I have cookies on the brain. So my thought was, let's try and replicate the colors of a gingerbread house gingerbread man so i've got my little gingerbread man and i just have a small canvas um, and these are the colors not my go-to colors these um but i'm going for gingerbread colors but i also wanted to show you um that you don't have to spend a ton of money on um, paint. These are all from Walmart, except for this one. This one, Arteza, is this color. Um, they are a little bit more expensive, but they have a, a nicer pigment. Um, I did get these 50% off, so why not? Um, and this is a, a metallic folk art, and the gold is metallic. And this white, I'm hoping, so this white has this glitter in it, shimmer, extreme glitter. And I'm hoping it looks like icing or snow. That's the hope. <laughs> All right. So this is just regular white. I'm gonna put a little white down to begin with, just to get started. Um, just spread it out a bit. And like I said, this is just white paint I got from Walmart. So you don't have to spend a lot of, so this is similar to the open cup pour, but it's not a round circular cup, it's the gingerbread man. So we'll see what happens. I don't know. <laughs> okay, so this is the color I, and we're gonna do straight in and it should um, seep out. The red and green are what I'm calling the, what? Candy canes and gumdrops. That's what we're going for. Okay. And so this is the white with the Glitter. So we'll just do a little of that. So we're just going to keep layering the colors in and we'll see what happens. I've made a 
a lot of cookies in my day. <laughs> so it's going to fill up. It might be seeping through. Um, it might not, but um, it's okay. I'll show you what we're going to do. So I hope you um, participate in the, the cookie um, recipe swap. I think it'll be fun. All right, so now it is filling up, but it is spreading out a little. See that? So what I'm gonna do is just gonna lift them up a little so that some of the paint comes out. Okay. Oh, well, I haven't put any green in. I don't want a lot of green. I don't want a little green. Mm -hmm. Yeah, these are definitely not the colors I go with. That's my furry friend again. He heard the word cookie. <laughs> He's like, where's my cookie? She keeps sending him cookie. Oh, I'm not going to do that one. I think we'll do some white again. He likes his cookies, but I don't know. All right, and it's getting full again. So I'm going to lift him up a little bit. <clears throat> so the thought is maybe I'll have a gingerbread man at the end. Uh, so I'm going to put a couple more colors in there. So I hope you get to bake some cookies for the holidays. No diet this time of year. All right, so I'm going to just, this is the white with the glitter. I'm gonna kind of see if I can do like an outline of a, the gingerbread man. Like icing, maybe. All right. And let's see. I definitely think that's enough paint. I'm gonna put the torch on in case there's any air bubbles before we spread our out. Distorted gingerbread man. <laughs> okay. So I'm gonna try and spread it so that I'm going to put a little of the white around, this is the regular white, the edges so that I don't totally lose all the colors we just did. So that helps the colors not roll over each other. Mm 
And that's one fat gingerbread. <laughs> I'm honestly not liking the middle. <laughs> Hmm. I don't know what to do with that. I'm not liking that. That's just I'm going to kind of spread some of this off. All right, I think this is where I'm gonna stop. So, like I said, it's not my, those are not my favorite cut browns, I mean, not favorite colors, um, but I did go out of my comfort zone. <laughs> so that's a cookie cutter, you know, work, work in progress, but I hope you, um, if you enjoyed this video, give us a thumbs up. I hope you do the cookie recipe swap. Um, send me a recipe that you'd like to share with all other people and, and other patrons, and we'll put something fun together. Keep watching. Uh, we have some fun winter-themed things coming up in the future. So I hope you're well. Have a great day. Peace.